Hello, YouTube family. Tom, a.k.a. Patrick, with Patrick's Playbook, I am here today with a Dollar Tree haul. It is our first Dollar Tree haul in almost three weeks. So it has been, I just want to say off the top, we have not been filming as often as we had when we first started the channel. We um, were all kind of adjusting to the high school schedule. You know, a lot of you know Mercy from the channel and um, her schedule is intense. There's lots going on, but she's having a great time. She loves it. You know, um, she's met some really nice friends and it can be tough in high school. There's a lot of, you know, little clicks and little clicky type things in high school as, as there was when I went to high school, you know, back in the 1980s. So just want to say off the top that thank you all of you who are watching this and sticking with the channel. And it's even though it's been so long since um, I have filmed or any of us have filmed, but we are back and I am so excited about this haul. I would like to say, if you are new to the channel, like, subscribe, leave a comment. We love comments, and I answer them all. I answer every single comment that anybody ever leaves. I, I just feel like if someone takes their time out of their day, their valuable time, to comment to me, then the least I can do is to comment back, and I love the back and forth of the comments. Without further ado, guys, let's begin. Okay. Before I begin the haul itself, and I will have a taste test at the end, um, I would like to keep a tradition going that I've started a couple months ago and talk about the Billboard Top 40 from September 26th, 1981. Every week I like to do um, a different, there's a local radio station here called KDWB 101.3. Every Saturday morning they do America's Top 40 and they pick kind of whatever date it is in real life, like the month of the day, and they pick a year. So last Saturday uh, was, they did September 26th, 1981. So I would like to tell you what the top five songs were on September 26th, 1981. Here goes. This is a fun one. Number five was There's No Getting Over Me by Ronnie Millsap, a country artist who kind of crossed over into the pop charts um, he was an amazing artist. My mom really loved Ronnie Millsap. I don't know his music super well, to be honest, but I remember that song very vividly. Number four was a song that I really, really like. Urgent by Foreigner. 70s and 80s rock band Foreigner. Love that song. Number three, Stop Dragging My Heart Around by Stevie Nicks and Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. An amazing duet between those two. Just wonderful vocals. Number two was The Queen of Hearts by Juice Newton. I bet a lot of you out there remember that. Wonderful song. And number one was one of the most popular songs of the entire 1980s. From the film soundtrack to the film Blue Lagoon, Diana Ross, Lionel Richie, Endless Love. Number one for an incredible nine weeks. And this in this week it was number it was the seventh week and it was number one. So just in a wonderful, different, eclectic top five. Leave a comment. Which of those five songs is your favorite? If you know those songs, if you were alive during that time, or even if you're just a fan of 80s music in general. Okay, without further ado, let's begin the haul. All right, this one is such a fine item to begin with. I wanted to start with this item. Look at this, everybody. Oh, my gosh. How cute is this? Little mismatched Santa and Friends gift set. You get six different individual socks, so you can mismatch your socks. Um, a couple of you have left me comments saying that you, you, um, you do mismatch your socks on purpose for fun. So I just thought this was so fun. Now, I'd like to point out, it is for kids. It is ages four to nine. But we just thought this was so much fun. So we picked that up. And can you believe that in the Dollar Tree, there are already Christmas items? Unbelievable. So we found that. We just thought that was the cutest thing ever. So we found that. Speaking of Christmas items, let's keep that theme going. I found, I think I have three Christmas items in this haul. Look at this, everybody. Look at these Christmas gnomes. Oh my goodness. 
look at how cute these are. Christmas house, um, you know, just two little Christmas gnomes on two red sticks. Cutest ever. So we found those. We just could not resist. We just, we just love gnomes. We just absolutely love gnomes. And then we found some Christmas ribbon. And I'll show you one at a time. Uh, this one, of course, with the red truck. And a little puppy dog in the back. How cute is that? And by the way, all of this ribbon is 12 feet of ribbon from Crafter Square. 5 eighths inch by 144 inches. 12 feet of ribbon. But look at that really cool, like I said, with the red truck. And it says Merry Christmas. The red truck and the puppy dog and the Christmas tree. So cute. So we found that design of ribbon. And then just the nice traditional, just with the words, Merry Christmas. Sorry for, sorry for the glare. I kind of wanted to show it a little bit close up. And same thing, 12 feet, 5, 8 inches. Well, this is 5... This one's actually nine feet. Sorry, the last one was 12 feet. This one, as you can see, is nine feet. And it is five eighths of an inch by nine feet. But look at this really cute design with the word Merry Christmas on it. Just nice and traditional. Again, I'm, I apologize for the glare, but I really wanted to show the design. And last but not least, oh, I love this red and white check. Love the red and white Christmas check. Oh my gosh. And this one is... 12 feet. So we're back to 12 feet. And again, 5 eighths of an inch by 144 inches. You can also look at it as it's also this is four yards. So 12 feet or four yards, but love that red and white check design. So Christmas items are, are you guys finding uh, Christmas items already? Christmas slash holiday items at your DTs. Let me know in the comments below. And of course, you know, we're still a month out from Halloween as I'm filming this. So I have a lot of Halloween slash fall type items for you, including this really fun kitty cat ears. Love this. You know, maybe Mercy will wear this on Halloween. Um, but we just love, we just absolutely love, we love cats in general. You know, we have a puppy dog. We have two cats. Um, just pretending, learn, glow, learn, grow, and play. Ages three and up. So we found that. Love the, love the glitter in there. So we found that for Halloween. These are really cool, I thought. These rings. Look at that. Bug rings, spider rings. It actually says, um, or it's a 10 piece. I, they're spiders, I guess they're not bugs. Well, I mean, spiders are insects. But yeah, so you get 10 spider rings. Five orange and five purple. So I just thought those are really cute. You can use these as decor. Obviously, you could also, you know, if you're a kid, you could wear those. I guess you can wear them even if you're not a kid, if you're a kid at heart. So I found that 10-piece spider ring for Halloween. How cute is that? And oh my gosh, for you cat lovers out there, or even I guess for you Halloween lovers, look at this. I love this retro kitty cat. Um, it kind of reminds me of maybe like the cat in Bewitched. You know, the black cat in Bewitched, like at the beginning of like the, the beginning, if you've ever seen the TV show, kind of the intro to it and it shows the little black cat. Oh my goodness. But how cute is that? Just this wonderful, absolutely delightful fabric. And the dimensions are 18 inches by 21, 100% cotton. But how absolutely adorable is that? And how retro is that cat? Kind of has the 1960s vibe. Just love it. Um, we found this. This is so cool. Just this little decor. It's got a little light in the bottom. Uh, make sure that it comes with a tab and make sure you pull the tab and then flip it on. For those of you who are light sensitive, look away for a second. Look at that. Just a little light inside there in the purple pumpkin. We have, um, we also had the orange pumpkins that we hauled in a previous haul. That we're using as our background um but yes look at this beautiful little purple pumpkin while i'm mentioning purple my vikings are two and one i just thought i'd throw that in the minnesota vikings are two and one play the new orleans saints on sunday in london i'll leave it at that so it's a fun start to the season 
for us Vikings fans. Um, comment below. Let me know how your NFL team is doing. I love, I love the entire, I love the whole NFL. Okay, so we also found, so fun, two different infinity scarves. Halloween, look at this. The, just the, just the nice, really good sized pumpkins on there. How fun. Love the infinity scarves. Really super fun. That one. And we found this one. I love this design. This is so cool. With like kind of the black car with the kind of the, um, it's a little bit of purple in there. The black kitty cat on top. How absolutely adorable is that? Look at the ghost here. And the truck with the pumpkins and the ghost that says boo. Oh my goodness. Cutest ever. Cutest ever. So we found that. And you got the shovel here. Very intricate designs for this. Yeah, so we found two different infinity scarves for Halloween. So I'm looking around. I think there's a couple more kind of fall type items, but I think that's it for specifically for Halloween items for this haul. And now I just have kind of a couple of different sort of autumn type items. We found these really cute uh, paper cups, 16 ounces. And here's kind of the design in here. Just the really fun autumn slash fall leaves. And again, these are 16 ounces. It also comes with this really fun band. This really fun, um, I want to see what the word says. Actually, you know, let me open this up super quick because I want to see what the band says. I can't tell what the word on the band is. I think it's, here, let me open these up super quick. Yeah, 16 ounces, you know, very substantial, um, you know, nice size cups. And you also get, I wanted to mention, you also, with the cups comes kind of the tops. So you get the four tops. Oh, so cool. And then the band says thankful. And we all have a lot to be thankful for in general, I think, you know, no matter how bad life gets, you can always be thankful for something just for being here and having the privilege of being alive is kind of a big deal, in my opinion, you know. So there you go. Beautiful 16 ounce cups. We found those for autumn. Really fun. And then these. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. So we have hauled um, other things with this design, plates, but we got some great ideas from a couple of different channels that said, you can use these for chili. How great of an idea is that? Who doesn't love a nice bowl of chili in the fall? And it's a six piece, eight ounce cups, but just look at that really fun design. And yeah, wouldn't that work just unbelievable for chili? That is making me so hungry. I have a feeling my taste test is gonna be pretty good scores. I am starving. Chili sounds so good right now. So we found those. So in this haul, that's about it for kind of the uh, Halloween and the Christmas items and the fall items. The rest are just kind of just everyday items. A super, some super, super fun stuff. Um, now we love notebooks in this house. Mercy really loves notebooks. We could not resist this one. Look at this, guys. Actually, it says journal. Journal, 60 sheets. You know, I call it a notebook, but it's, you know, a journal slash notebook. Look at this. A dinosaur with a backwards baseball cap riding a skateboard with tennis on, tennis shoes. How fun and adorable is that? You got the little band here and just the traditional paper, you know, just traditional notebook paper. But like I said, we, we have so many notebooks, but we couldn't resist that one. Mercy will just love this. So it's a little journal slash notebook. So we found that. And then, oh my gosh, Mercy is going to paint this for Halloween. So it's a dollhouse with furniture, uh, but, and we've seen this on other channels, so we cannot take credit for this idea, but on other channels, people have um, painted this black and maybe some orange and just some Halloween type colors and just painted it for Halloween. So Mercy is going to do that. Um, she's super busy, but she'll find time on the weekend to do that. So 
we will get that painted up before Halloween and we will show you when it's finished. Mercy's, she loves doing stuff like that. Oh my gosh. Um, now, I have worn a Tom and Jerry shirt on this channel before. Actually, I've worn two different Tom and Jerry shirts. My name is Tom. It's one of my favorite cartoons of all time. It might be my number one. It's between that, Scooby-Doo, right up there, SpongeBob. But look at this adorable bag. We've looked for this bag for so long. We finally found it. Life is sweet. Tom, Jerry, one of Jerry's friends, um, looking at the ice cream cone. How absolutely lovely is that? So fun of a bag. And yeah, just with the actual, you know, you got the whole kind of the Warner Brothers tag there for Tom and Jerry. But yeah, the bag here, that's what it looks like on the sides. Love the color and absolutely just love this bag. So we found that. And then Mercy's friend is a huge Lilo and Stitch fan, particularly the character Stitch. So Mercy thought of her when she got this. Just a bag with the character Stitch on it prominently. How fun is that? Uh, myself, I've actually never seen the show Lilo and Stitch. But I've heard a lot about it. And there you go. We found a Lilo, actually just a Stitch bag. The character Stitch. But I just love that color. Isn't that a cool color? Have you guys seen these? Either this or the Tom and Jerry bag in your DTs. So we found those. Speaking of bags, we found these cosmetic bags and took one out of the, I took this off and this off and I'm gonna show you in a second. Um, but just, yeah, Ever a Beauty cosmetic bag, wide spacious compartment with interior slip pocket, six and a half inches by 3.2 inches by 4.5 inches are the dimensions of that. So we got two of them. And here is one that I wanted to show you. I took the, all the stuff off because I wanted to show you. So just, you know, kind of the zipper here. You know, and it's kind of a vinyl type material. Look at all the room inside here. So we found those. And, oh my gosh. I wanted to show you this. Let me open this up, actually. This is um, it's a shoe storage bag. You know, and you can fit eight pairs in here. So let me open this up and show you. I love the color first off. Cool, navy type of color. Okay. So this guy, yeah, fits eight pairs of shoes. But look at this. That is so neat. Actually, yeah, it's gonna, it's so big, it's gonna go off camera a little bit, but yeah, so each, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it fits eight pairs of shoes. Just, to, I mean, for a dollar 25. Like, are you kidding me? How cool, how absolutely cool is that? So we found that, and again, I just love that color. Love it, love it, love it. So we picked that up. And then, you know, we've picked up a lot of these type of candles, but this is the first time that I have found this color, kind of the purple. Well, not kind of the purple, the purple. And it says candle clear purple. You know, so we might craft with these or we might just use them as is and use them as a candle. But we just love, uh, you know, we might melt them down and use them as melts or just use them as is, but use them as is, sorry. Um, but yeah, just really cool. Just absolutely love that color. So we picked those two candles up. Yeah, again, this was, I, this was a really, you know, hadn't done a haul in so long. Um, my last haul was an Aldi haul, and I just could not wait to do a Dollar Tree haul again. You know, kind of went away from it for a little bit, but we are back. Now, it is beautiful weather in Minnesota, but for any of you who live in either Minnesota or the five state area or the Midwest or the East Coast, we all know what's coming. Cold weather is coming. It's beautiful today, but we all know cold weather is coming. We picked up two pairs of men's gloves 
from Juncture, and these have, the, they're texting gloves. They're actually texting gloves, so you can text, you know, the phone recognizes your hand in these, which is really cool. Because, you know, if you're wearing gloves, it's obviously hard to text, but not with these. You can actually, you know, you put them on, and you can use these two fingers. You can text with them. So those are nice. So we were happy to pick up, and I really enjoy both of these colors. If I had to kind of pick between colors, I'd probably lean a little bit this way. But yeah, I mean, for $1.25, that is pretty nice find there, I thought. And then, oh my gosh, guys, these work so well. We picked up three of these utility, three of these utility knives. We love these. These work really well. So, we got three of those. We've gotten these before, but they just they just work so well that I wanted to show these. So pick these up if you can. They are really, really, they really come in handy. And then, um. As you can see, I don't need these, what I'm about to show you, but the ladies will use these. Two combs, and my son's hair is kind of short too, so. But the ladies will use these, two really fun colors there, kind of a turquoise and, you know, kind of a lighter purple. So we found those two combs. And then we got these. Makeup remover, cleansing wipes. You get 25 towelettes. Kind of show that up close there. Hope there's not too much glare. Yeah. So these will work really well, or they do work really well. So we found those. Okay, now we had just picked up a Bissell Steam Shot Deluxe. So we're really looking forward to trying that. And we are hoping that these work well with that. These are, as you can see, microfiber washcloths. And we kind of got these as a companion to the Bissell Steam Shot. And they are 11 inches by 11 inches. So yeah, we will let you know how those go. But yeah, these are just a five pack, 11 by 11. And we are gonna use that with our Bissell Steam Shot Deluxe. So we picked those up. Oh my gosh, this is so fun here. Now, I have heard a lot about this movie. I've never seen the film myself, just, but these characters are so fun. Mercy just thought these were the funnest pickups. We found five action figures from the film Madagascar. And I'll read them one at a time. This is Gloria. How fun is that? The hippo. And the giraffe, Melman, from Madagascar. Comment below, have you seen the film Madagascar from several years back? And do you like it? Here is Alex the lion. King Julian. I think he kind of, he kind of stole the movie. I think he was kind of the, the really funny one. And Marty the zebra. Love that. Marty the Zebra. So yeah, we found all five five of action figures from the film Madagascar. So Mercy was super excited that we found those in the toy section, obviously. Now, this I had shown in a previous haul. This really fun container with the truck. I'm only showing it, again, to point out that we found the same container same size and exact same container with this beautiful design here. Happy fall wishes with the two pumpkins and the leaves and the acorn. So we found that. And let me tell you this, you can just, a lot fits in here. These are just such a nice container. Very, very nice. So just wanted to point that out. We found this really fun container that says happy fall wishes. Super cool. And I kind of have some sort of kind of hair care and beauty products to show you. I'll show you those all at once here. Now, Mercy and her mom are going to try out several different 
shampoos and conditioners that we found. And let me start with these. Spa Luxury. Repairing Shampoo, Honey Royal Jelly and Propellus Extracts, 12 ounces. And the companion is, and interesting that the bottle goes the other way for the conditioner. Um, Spa Luxury Repairing Conditioner, Honey Royal Jelly and Propellus. So kind of uh, companions there. So they will try those out. Super fun. Paraben free. Yeah, 12 fluid ounces on both of those. So they're going to try those. And then they are going to try these. And this is PS Clean Beauty Defining Shampoo for Curls. As well as... P.S. Clean Beauty Gentle Conditioner for Curls. So we found those. Now, Silk Salon Extra Hold Hairspray. Infused with argon and coconut oils. So we found that. And then this, this is a really good deal. Just three bars of just... Everyday Irish Spring Soap. Three bars of soap for a buck twenty-five. Sports strength, antibacterial. Sorry for the glare. And you know, you just get three traditional 3.7 ounce bars of soap. And then this one we've been looking for for a little bit. Uh, this is Colgate Renewal Revitalizes Gums. And sensitivity repair, um, reversing early damage. Yeah, but this is just... You know, we, um, we've heard a little bit about this. Usually this is a lot more expensive, you know, in the department stores and wherever they sell Colgate. So that's a really good deal for buck twenty-five. So we found that. And then, oh my gosh, this is kind of a fun one. Now, I'm sure this has been out for a while, but we've actually never used this. Um, where you put, you put the, um, the dishwasher soap in there. But soap dispensing brush from Scrub Buddies. Then you put it in there. And not just that, but how fun to find two refills for it. So we were really excited to find the refills. So yeah, a Scrub Buddy dispensing brush with two refills. How fun. All right. So, getting towards the end, almost ready for the taste test. Just maybe have about 10 quick items left. Um, just get to finish the cleaning. Everything with cleaning products. I have four more cleaning products, and then everything else is food. Okay, we found this. We're going to try this. Um, LA's Totally Awesome Bathroom Cleaner. Have not given this one a try yet. You get quite a bit. You get 32 ounces. Soap, scum, and stain remover. Fresh scent. Yeah, so we'll give that a try for a dollar twenty-five. Why not give that a try? And then this was this kind of made me laugh because for those of you who remember, like in the nineties, two thousands, uh, the Sham Wow, like on the on the kind of made for TV um, ads, this is very similar to like a Sham Wow, handy chamois. So we kind of picked that up as kind of a you know it's kind of a funny and nostalgia thing, but it might work. We'll try it. We'll give it a try. We've never tried it before. You know, it is 16 and a quarter inches, five holds, holds five times its weight in liquid, it says. So we will see. We'll try that out. We just, it was kind of, it kind of gave us nostalgic vibes for the ShamWow. So we found that. And then just these really cool reusable wipes from Brillo, name brand. You get nine of them. 11.8 inches by 19.7. Multi-use for every day. Yeah, just, just you know, Brillo Basics. Nice name brand. You get nine of them. Not bad for buck twenty-five. So we found those. And then we have hauled this before, but just wanted to show it again that we picked this up. Just a nice bar mop towel. You know, chiffon. Just traditional, just for, you know, mopping your counter and all that fun stuff around the house. So we picked that up. So there you have it. Now, everything else in this haul is food with a taste test at the end. So 
Um, I don't know about you all, but I love tacos, and we found we're going to try this flavor, or this brand, rather, of taco seasoning. This is Kelowna, made in North Bergen, New Jersey, for all of you East Coasters and a um, couple of people who, friends of ours who comment to the channel are from New Jersey. Hello to you. Zero calories. There's kind of the, some of the info there for this, but yeah, just taco seasoning. We're really looking forward to trying this. We've never tried this brand before. So pick that up for $1.25. Not bad, not bad. And then... For New York, for you New Yorkers, and by the way, for you New Yorkers, Aaron Judge, New York Yankees, ties Roger Maris's all-time home run record with 61. Pretty exciting stuff. Pretty exciting stuff. Pretty historic. But we found this, and this is um, Junior's, which is from Brooklyn. Most fabulous Brooklyn brand blend medium roast ground coffee. Four ounces, but look at that. Since 1950. Um, for those of you in New York City or those of you who have visited, have you ever been or bought this? Juniors from Brooklyn. We're going to give that a try. We thought that was a really fun find. So we got that. And then a couple of different um, seasonings here is we found, you know, of course, everyone knows these two brands, actually. We found um, Lowry's Garlic Salt, coarse ground with, bar with uh, parsley. It's just one ounce made with sea salt, but yeah, we're going to give that, um, we've looked for that in like a regular grocery store. We couldn't find it. We're like, oh, we found it at the Dollar Tree. So even though it's only an ounce, that's a lot, you know, it's a lot for a spice. We found that. And then two different seasonings from McCormick. They're both grill mates. So you have, um, McCormick grill mates. Montreal steak and doesn't that sound absolutely delicious it is gluten-free and on this it is again one ounce so yeah next time we make a steak that sounds absolutely fabulous doesn't it we'll try this out and again great name brand McCormick and then roasted garlic and herb seasoning yummy 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 oh my gosh this looks so good one ounce and again gluten free. We found those. And then just a couple more candies and then time for the taste test. Actually, oh, one cookie and two candies. So we have hauled these before, but I just wanted to show that we picked this up again. Oven baked, fudge striped shortbreads. Love these. Fudge striped shortbread cookies, 13 ounces. Yum, yum, yum. Absolutely adore these. And then I'm a big Butterfinger fan, so we found these. These are unwrapped minis from Butterfinger. There's the info on the back. I'm not going to taste test these because I have had these hundreds of times in my life, obviously. Well, I shouldn't say obviously, but hundreds of times in my life. Yeah, but that's not bad for buck twenty-five to get some unwrapped minis. You get two point eight ounces. And then for Halloween slash autumn. Brock's, Brock's Autumn Mix. And here is your calorie information on the back. I was gonna say, I would like to just point out that Brock's is a kind of a staple of a brand, as you all know. There's kind of the, the info, but we just, we absolutely love these. You know, you've got the regular candy corn and you've got kind of this flavor candy corn. And then I love these pumpkins with kind of the green top. Those are so tasty. So we found those. And guys, we had a lot of items there. That is it for the haul itself. Taste test time. Let's go. Only two items today. Oh, I want to. I want to say. I want to say something about the taste test and ask a question. So, we haven't done a Dollar Tree haul in almost three weeks, and yet we are kind of running out of items to taste test. We we're a couple last times we're at the Dollar Tree. We're like, actually, we've tried almost everything. In our, in our halls that they have. So we're kind of running out. So do any of you have ideas? Is there anything from the Dollar Tree, from your local Dollar Trees, that you would like to see me taste test? Just no big deal if you can't think of anything. If any of you think of anything, let me know and I will try it. Okay, so I only have two items today. And this is from Tootsie Roll. These are the Tootsie, the Tootsie Company, rather. 
watermelon dots. Now, I love dots. Every time I go to a movie in the theater, like I saw Elvis in a the theater, I saw Top Gun Maverick in a the theater, I love dots, 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 yum, yum, yum. And I usually love anything watermelon. So I am very optimistic about this, but believe it or not, in my entire life, I have never tried watermelon dots. So we're gonna fix that right now. We are gonna try some watermelon dots right now and give it a score. I have my trusty McDonald's Coca-Cola to try, to wash it down with rather. So here we go. Now, dots, um, it's a very small label. So let me just show you, let me just tell you, it's a hundred calories per serving. The serving per container is six. So there's eight dots to a serving. So if you eat eight dots, it is 100 calories. I won't eat eight here, I'll eat three. How about that? Or two. So, yum, yum, yum. Watermelon dots. I assume they're going to be yum. I've never tried them before. They look like this. Just how you would expect them to look. Here we go, everybody. Down the hatch. Oh my gosh. Wonderful. That is for me. As everyone knows with dots, it takes a while. Roof of your mouth, the whole nine yards. Okay, that is absolutely delicious. I love watermelon. I love anything watermelon. No exception here. 9.3. Go get these. Take them to a movie. Oh my gosh. Absolutely delicious. Watermelon dots. I figured I would like them. Didn't know I'd like them quite that much. 9.3. 9.3. Wash it down. Okay. Here we go. L really looking forward to this one. This is... For all of you Chicagoans out there, and by the way, your bears are two and one. Congratulations. And they play my Vikings in a couple weeks. I can't wait. Chicago American. Chicago Caramel and Cheddar Popcorn. Never had this. And I'm really looking forward to this. And um, as you would expect, it is distributed by Chicago American Sweets. Uh, there are three and a half servings per container. A serving size is one cup. The calories are 130 calories per serving. So let's give this a try. So let me just show you if you want to freeze the label there. Sorry for the glare, but if you want to freeze that, pause it on your screen to see the other um, info there, you can. This looks delicious. This looks absolutely delicious. Caramel and cheddar popcorn. Oh, it looks so good. Here's what it looks like. Wow, look at that. This looks really good, but let's try it. Okay, Chicago American, Chicago Caramel. Sorry, there's a bit of a glare there. Caramel and cheddar popcorn. Let's go. Yes. I should have known. If there is one thing about Chicago, Illinois, you all know food. I mean, seriously, pizza, hot dogs, barbecue. I should have known. Anything from Chicago, absolutely delicious. I'll see your football team in two weeks when they come to Minnesota, but yum, yum, yum. 9.3, same as the dots, an A, an absolute A. Wow, what a great taste test. What a fun taste test. Thank you all so much for watching this haul. I know it's been a while. Thank you for sticking with our channel. I know it's been, we've been so busy with high school stuff. Not an excuse, just a reason. Just want to let everyone know we're going to try to film more. You know, when Mercy's Volleyball comes to an end, we should be able to film more. But thank you so much for sticking with our channel. I love all of you. Absolutely love you. I feel like we are family. So thank you so, so much. Like, subscribe, comment, hit the bell for notification. Until next time, everyone, keep shining, keep smiling, keep shopping.